Hey guys, so today I wanted to do this makeup tutorial on this look. It's a spring slash summer makeup look. So if you want to know how I did it, just keep on watching and let's get started. So for this tutorial, I'm just going to be doing the eyes and finishing off the face. So let's get started. I am using the Tartlet in Bloom palette and I'm using Charmer and putting that all over my eyelid and using a flat brush I'm going to be using the color Sweetheart and I'm going to put that on the outer and inner corners of my eyes then I'll be using the tip of that brush and connecting the outer and inner corners together if that makes sense you'll see what I'm talking about it's like really hard to explain that <laughs> With a blending brush, I'm going to use the color Smarty Pants and I'm just going to blend that out as you can see. And then going back with the color Sweetheart, I'm going to go and apply those colors on the outside and inner corners of my eyes. Once again, just to like blend it all together. Um, with another flat brush, we're going to go in with the color Leader. And do the same thing as by putting it on the outer and inner corners of my eyes. And the reason as to why I'm doing this is because I want to start off with the light colors and then the dark colors. Just to get the blending effect and making it look more uh, blended because that's the way we want it to look, right? <laughs> Next, we're going to get the color Funny Girl, and I'm going to spritz it with some Fix Plus so the color is intensified. And I'm going to put that all over the middle part of my eyelid. And I'm just going to go a little past my crease, and I'm just going to repeatedly put that color on just to intensify it more. And since it is a shimmery color, I like to pack on the color first and then sweep it to blend the colors together. Going in with a smudge brush, I'm going to use the color Sweetheart to blend all the colors in because blending it is your best friend. So it's all about the blending today guys. I don't know if you noticed, but yes, I am blending a lot because it's a lot. Using the color Charmer, I'm just going to go highlight my brow bone just to finish off the eyeshadow part of the look. Moving on to liner, I'm using my go-to liner, which is a Benefit Their Real Liner. It is my best friend, and I am going to line my eyes with it, like always. So, once I curl my lashes, I'm going to put on some falsies. I'm using the Red Cherry Lashes in number 43. And once those lashes are set, I'm going to put on some mascara to bring my fake lashes and my real lashes together. And I'm just going to be... Uh, putting mascara on my real lashes. I'm not putting on my fake lashes. I'm using the Urban Decay Perversion Bigger Blacker Batter Mascara. That is a wordful. Onto the under eyes, I'm using Leer to smoke out my eyes. And using a smudging brush, I'll be using the color Sweetheart to blend those two colors together to make it a lot more smokier and have that ombre blending effect and to finish off the eye look i'll be using a pencil liner to just line my eyes and that should be it for the eyes so moving on to the face i will be using my anastasia contour palette and i'll be using the color banana and i am putting it under my eyes and i'm putting it on the bridge of my nose I'm putting it under my cheekbones. I'm just putting it on wherever I usually put it on. And then for contouring, I am using the bottom three colors. Like I mix all three colors. So I put it on my cheekbones. And I also put it on my forehead. I like to put a lot because I have a big forehead. And I'd like to reduce that look. And I also put it on my chin, my jawline, whatever you call it. 
And on my nose, I'm using an angled brush and I'm just shaping my nose. And then I'm using the blending brush to just blend it because I don't like it looking too intense because it's just too obvious. And then for my blush, I'm using the color Fancyful from the Tarte Amazonian Clay 24 hour blush. And to highlight my face, I am going to be using Champagne Pop by Jaclyn Hill. And I'm going to do my cheekbones and I am doing the bridge of my nose. And using my finger, I am doing the upper lip as well. So that is it for the face. And last but not least, I am moving on to the lips. To finish off the look, I am using the ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in the color Solo. And I'm putting that all over my lips. And that's the finished look, guys. So if you guys like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. If you guys want more, please do not forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.